Alright guys, welcome back to another reaction and today I am reacting to the first episode of The Mighty Ducks Game Changers. Um, based off the trailers, I'm a little optimistic, not really not really sure what this is gonna entail, but um, it's Mighty Ducks and it's hockey, so I'm gonna check it out. My cousin Sam has his long curly hair, he calls it his hockey flow. Well, that's uh, that's interference. I've gotten a penalty for doing that exact thing that he just did. Now that's bull. Don't bother. Don't bother. Come on, please. Yeah, exactly. If you're not great, don't bother. You know. That makes no sense. You never bought into any of this craziness. I just did it because my kid loves hockey. But I guess that doesn't matter now. So let me lay a couple of truths on you guys. This scene is nuts. The 6 a.m. practices. The thousand dollar clinics. Godlike worship of protein. Do you understand that there is about zero chance that any one of these kids is going to play professional hockey? So why are you living like this? Stephanie, you brought two private trainers to your kids' hockey practice. Does that seem normal to you? Well, I'm not a trainer, I'm a pediatric sports psychologist. Uh, does no one see the insanity but me? These parents are serious, right? They came here to win. We're not here to have fun. Guys, shouldn't kids be able to play? They are taking. Fun? Yeah, these people are taking it way too seriously. Wow. Ed, come in here. Look at this. Your first teammate. Teammate. I don't know what to say. Yes, you can't. <laughs> Six players? I don't like that this series is portraying the Ducks as the villains, though. This is a Mighty Ducks series, and the Mighty Ducks are the villains right now. I don't know how I feel about that. What was that? Did you do that on purpose? I noticed you enjoy explaining your body. I'm sorry, I gotta go. These hockey parents in the ducks are way too serious for some reason. I know you're all popular and winners at the game of life, but Why is he getting made fun of because of his mom going off on the coach? You can do that? He just has everyone in the school's number. He has the number of everyone in the school, <laughs> like. No time. 
<laughs> I haven't played NHL in a long time. I should play it again. I should get the uh, newest one, 21, and play it. I could play it on the channel. of a slop is this kid? Yes! <laughs> what you said is move me. I will be your mom. Thank you, Coop 13. Twice. Men don't cut their grapes. This is cool. I've never I've never seen something like this. Team Day. I'd never heard of something like that. It's kind of cool.
These kids don't even know how to skate. us. <laughs> anything like the movies by the end of this series this team is gonna beat the mighty ducks <laughs> I can't <laughs> I can't <laughs> that would never happen that's impossible for these kids who've never even skated in their lives are gonna beat the powerhouse team that is the Mighty Ducks. Uh, but I mean, it would it would continue the trend of the Mighty Ducks movies being so unrealistic, <laughs> and like it would never happen. But, like, I don't like them painting the Mighty Ducks as the villains or the antagonistic team, like the Hawks or the. Yeah, the varsity team and the third one. Um, like, this is a Mighty Ducks series, and it's not even about the Mighty Ducks. <laughs> so, I mean, that's a little odd. But, um, it was alright, and I'm obviously I'm going to watch the rest of the show. And, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I think the comedy was um, decent for the first episode, and I mean, obviously, um, Gorham Bombay is definitely going <laughs> to play a role in coaching or managing or something, the team. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to the first episode of the Mighty Ducks Game On, and uh, stay tuned for next week, where episode two will drop, and, well, this series, every episode is dropping the same day as Falcon and the Winter Soldier, so I'm filming this on the same day that I reacted to the Falcon and the Winter Soldier episode 2. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.